This tutorial is going to show you how to add uh, speech bubbles to pictures. Uh, previously I made a video on how to do it using uh, Balloons Free, which is a good little free app. Uh, this one's going to allow you to make some more comic sort of style ones. So we're going to use Comic Life for this uh, particular tutorial. So I'm going to find my Comic Life. Okay, and with an iPad, um, often you have to do sort of little workarounds to get the result you, you want. That's the same as a laptop, you need to use different software for getting different things. So I'm going to create a fresh blank one. Um, I'm then going to add a box. So these boxes here allow you to add pictures. So I'm going to make a nice big box so that I have a nice big picture. I'm going to press on the picture button and I'm going to get a picture from my camera roll. So I'm going to use my cat, seems to be a popular one. You can scale it to adjust how big you want it to be. I'm going to just get its face because it's going to have a speech bubble. Okay, then I can drag the speech bubble over the top and make it say something profound. And select all. I can then press on the I button to make my text bigger. And I can select my speech bubble and make that bigger as well. Okay, so it's probably about the right size. Cool, I'm happy with that. Uh, there are some different speech bubbles as well. Um, and you can also add some text if you like to add some text. Okay, so. And you can create the, make the boxes bigger and smaller as well. Okay, so to get it out, uh, this application has um, the option to um, export as a picture, so I don't need to use my screenshot function. If any application doesn't have the option to export as an image, you can always do a screenshot and then we can trim it later on. So I'm going to press on the spanner button to export, share and print. I want to share to my photo library. So I'm going to do a nice high poly JPEG and that will give me the option to trim it later on. Okay, so now I want to get out of my comic life. I'm going to go to my camera roll. Cancel. Okay, I want to press edit. I can then press crop on the bottom right and that will allow me to select the part of the picture which I'd like to use. So I only want the bit that has the meow part. So I can trim that down. Okay. Press crop and save. It's trying to make me project onto my screen. Okay, so now I have a picture of my cat with a speech bubble. So then I can use this in my iMovie presentation or a slideshow or whatever I'm doing.